I'm originally from Australia, so I'm an Australian citizen. I work for the Electronic Frontier Foundation, which is an international uh, civil society non-governmental organisation based in San Francisco. We're interested in talking about a number of issues relating to creativity and innovation on the internet and correspondingly a number of threats to the future of the internet. Well, I see two possible futures for the internet. One is where internet users are disconnected from the internet for alleged copyright infringement. One of the proposals that we're seeing being discussed in Europe and in the international forum such as proposed any counterfeiting trade agreement and we're also concerned about proposals that would require internet service providers and internet intermediaries to filter content on the internet for alleged copyright infringing material. We think that will slow down innovation on the internet and has a number of privacy concerns and due process concerns for internet users. Well, the internet is an amazing platform for open innovation. What I would like to see the internet become and what the future I hope comes to pass is a future where we see innovative new ICTs coming into play that will foster international cooperative efforts, things like digital education that make possible uh, the ability for students who live in remote communities without access to libraries and books to have access to digital copies of the collective knowledge of humankind. We currently have the ability to digitise the collective works of mankind. We may one day in the future soon have the technological ability to make that available to the world's citizens. But that in turn is going to depend on having international and national copyright frameworks that provide room for technological innovation but also provide space for human development. I think everyone agrees that the you know, internet is a platform for innovation and development. How you get there is going to be the interesting question. Rights holders, copyright owners in particular, have a particular view about innovation on the internet that I think lies at odds with many of uh, the views of citizens who want to get onto the internet and create content with the goal of sharing and creating and participating in, in the web. And those two cultures are never going to see eye to eye. I'm hoping that multi-stakeholder forums such as this process will allow governments, policymakers, businesses and the creative community to be able to sit down together and work out what they have in common so that the future of the internet is positive and not negative. Inspiration.